Hi guys, it is such a great pleasure for me to bring to you another super excited episode of Celebrities on, on Galaxy Television. My name is Fukushin. Thank you so very much for joining me today. Like always, guys, I'm not alone today. Anyway, there's no way I can be able to celebrities on the you know, I have to bring this celeb to you on the show. And today, joining me on the show is, um, I love to call her, you know, the street goddess. Yeah. <laughs> she's a rapper, she's a singer, she's multi talented. Yeah, just take it away. It doesn't mean maybe she's doing plenty of things, but yeah, she's multi talented with the voice. Joining me today is the one and the only Miss <laughs> Miss Kiss in the building, people. <laughs> My god, you have to do that. <laughs> yeah, you know, roll the drum. <laughs> How you doing? I am good. You look so beautiful. You look pretty yeah. too. You know, I told you that when we were coming yeah, here. Yeah, yeah. Thank you so very much. Wow. Thank you for joining me to be on the show. Thank you for having me. Miss Kiss. Okay, you know, I'm so much curious right now. Your name is Amori. Where we call right. you? Miss Kiss. Where did you get that name from? I know. You guys were expecting me to take O from one me, then J from just another than A. Okay. I should be O J. <laughs> Something like that. <laughs> yeah, but... Um, a woman. A woman, no. I got that um, name from a friend. Kiss. It was actually Kiss. Kiss yeah. Daniel? No, not... No, I don't mean that. I mean, the name that was given is Kiss. Okay, Kiss. Actually, okay. Yes. You kiss a lot. Like, no, didn't you? Yeah, like, I don't... Nah, nah, nah. <laughs> Why would someone give you Kiss? <laughs> no, it, it was just... You know, when I started music okay. professionally, we're okay. trying to, you know, normally you're supposed to find a stage name first for yourself yeah, after you found your sound. Yeah. So we're just trying to find which name that I could hold on to and yeah. people could remember easily. Yeah. You know? So someone just came up with Kiss. Okay. It was just a random thing. Okay. So I was Kiss for a while. We even had the full meaning for Kiss. Ooh. Knowledge inspires special souls. That thing still makes me laugh too tomorrow. Seriously, when I like, knowledge inspires special souls. Is that what I was wow. supposed to be bearing a lot of You know, so I was I was Kiss for like um, up to two years. Okay. And but the issue we had was every time we released my songs, people yeah. don't easily get it on on the internet okay. because of the name. Mm-hmm. Every time you Google Kiss, all you get is all sorts. Yeah. So we decided to just add something to it and we added Miss to it. So that's how we have Miss Kiss. Ah, beautiful. Well, you said something like that. I said um, after getting your sound, you must get yourself the stage, the stage name. Is that really right. true? Like a must, is it truly a must? You have to, there, there have to be a name people will call you. I mean, you can be your name, okay. whatever you're okay. comfortable yeah. with, yeah. yeah. But then they have to be a name okay. because you can't just come as anonymous. <laughs> okay, definitely. Now tell us, you know, your growing up story. How was it like for you growing up? Growing up was fantastic. Mm-hmm. I'm from, you know, a family that uh, have, like, they truly believe in God. Okay. that kind of family yeah, yeah. and um, my mom you know raised us in a way that we thought to be very strong and to be independent oh, okay. so music runs in the family so it wasn't like a shock when I started to do music oh, it wasn't okay. a shock to them okay. you know we all grew up in church we, my sisters and I were choristers in church yeah. oh. my brother drummed in church so he's a producer now so wow. really, everything just works it's not like oh but then they expect me to you rap it like this, no. <laughs> you know, church. But the, yeah, <laughs> but then it's not like they, my family encouraged music. You know, whatever, however you want to put it, music mm-hmm. is music. Mm-hmm. So, well, that the, the family the whole thing. That that's how it is anyway. Okay, okay. And then that's it. All right, up. all right. You said your brother is a producer. That's Has he right. produced any of your songs? Not yet, mm-hmm. because he's he's not. He's it should be his number there. one um, customer. Something like that. Ah, he has plenty of customer. Yes. He's a star, should be there now. He's a star man. Never stop away. <laughs> <laughs> so it's it's just it's been it's, it's been amazing. Okay. I mean, the old support is, okay. is wonderful. My mom is happy. Okay. All right then. So professionally, when did you start singing? Uh I started professionally 20, 2011. Oh, okay. Yeah, because so 2010 was when I got into the studio. Mm-hmm. But when I started to put out music, I think it was 2011. Okay. And at 2013, I got um, my first deal mm-hmm. with Gambit, Paul okay. Gambit. Yeah. yeah, that was about yeah. bad, bad dog entertainment. Mm-hmm. And at 2014, I got my first deal with Capital Hill Music mm-hmm. and T Date. Okay. 
beautiful. You know, you've been producing, you've been delivering a lot of great songs, and everyone thinks you're Nigerian. Nicki like Minaj. Like but then I read it somewhere that you, um, your role model is Beyonce. Fortunately. Beyonce is a rapper. <laughs> how would you take? How would a rapper take Beyonce as a role model? Now, when, when I when I mean, it depends on your definition of role model. Because okay. for me, it doesn't necessarily mean who you who you actually you know, take music from. For me yeah. as an artist, I mean, yeah. it could be their lifestyle, mm. their personality, the kind of how people see them. Okay. That's how you want people to see you. That's okay. for me. You know, Beyonce is someone people you know, really respect and then she's legendary. Okay. She's been doing this for years. She's quite strong and then mm-hmm. she's giving it. Mm-hmm. You know, she's killing it. So mm-hmm. that's just it for me. That's how I would look people to see me okay you know when before we started the show guys she was delivering some beautiful songs and i was like hmm. in my mind i was like she's a rapper but she sings so well so why have you chosen just to rap to, 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 to you know to be doing rap song when you can actually do every other thing you can do well in r b yeah i can see that yeah so actually rap and sing i've had i've had a couple of songs that, that I, I you know didn't sing it on and that's fuji yeah. Fuji, yeah, I sang mm-hmm. Fuji. I didn't necessarily do rap, it was a little rap. So yeah. I've been very versatile from okay. day one, you know. Okay. And people already know, I think few people know. Okay. Few, they just want to see the, the madness. They, they, every time I try to be on stage, someone just wants to bring out and bury me. <laughs> <laughs> okay. All right, you're not talking about the agro thing. Those times that people were at you. Okay, there's no time I watch videos on YouTube. I'm going to check the comments, you know. And there were comments there that. This girl, let's go decide it yourself so I can flow and don't. I was trying, I, was, I told myself that I tried to be modest. No, but you said it yourself. Yeah. We we're like, ah, this is grass, come on, something like that. <laughs> Seriously. So you, you've gotten things like that. Absolutely. Like, mm-hmm. that, that is like what I preach, you know. Okay. My music, my sound yeah. is, is, is from the streets. That's why I grew up. There's yeah. no portion in this thing. Mm-hmm. I grew up from the streets. Mm-hmm. And, and, you know, coming from the street, the streets is very aggressive. Yeah. You can't come in, you want to say you're from the street and you're all switched up. No, man. Uh-huh. That place is something that's like happening there. So you have to come the way it actually is. Okay. You understand me? Okay. So all, all what you get now is me being artistic. I mean, it's right for me to be able to grant interviews like this. Mm-hmm. And then, mm-hmm. But you normally know, when I get in the studio, you know, I want to talk to my people, you know, ah, it's another. <laughs> Hey, seriously. You see the switch? I'm I'm surprised. Not I'm not really surprised though, but then I tell I told the guys earlier that she's got a talent and so when it comes to switching from the posh person, how would you think Miss Kiss speaks for like this? Seriously. Um, um, flowing, you know, the background, man, uh-huh. really. In in our house, you 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 can't just speak stupid. Yeah, yeah, really. English. Like, yeah, you was uh, were quite disciplined. Wow. My so dad, we were not very rich, okay. but my okay. parents raised as well. Okay, with that kind of upbringing, um, what would you think that your parents would frown at you going into the streets of music? Unfortunately, my dad was late. Okay, he is late, and okay. before I started to, you know, do music okay. like this, but my mom didn't know for a while. Like, yeah, she, yeah, yeah, she wasn't part of it for a while. Like, she wow. didn't know I was doing music until something happened you know she she came to visit me and then she was going through my phone and she saw pictures and like ah, why are you doing to do model why are you taking professional pictures <laughs> okay you can't lie now <laughs> <laughs> I'm like um, um, uh, doing music Hong Kong. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> you know how parents are so but i, I did play my song because then i was just trying to you know get my demo yeah but it wasn't a big deal so she yeah. felt like oh well, yeah you're still young so every time you know what you want to do with your life okay <laughs> but then it started to get big yeah i got my first contract and it was not okay, like okay wow. this girl is not joking wow. <laughs> you get yeah and then she started to support me that's how your family is whatever you want to do they support you Awesome stuff. Well done to you. Right now, I want us to check out your song. Gotta be Fuji. Talk about it. So good to know that you guys are still tuned in, watching the show right here. And of course, I've still got me skis right here with you. I hope you guys enjoyed that song. Eh? Yes. I saw the energy there. It's so good. <laughs> energy vibe. And which was? 
<laughs> dance well and sing well. Really, Thank which you. one do you do much training on singing or dancing? Yeah, or music, they're both natural. Music is everything. Music is everything for okay. me. Okay, but dance, you have to. You just me like. I won prizes growing up. I danced in every competition, every yeah. party. So really? Dances, yeah, it's not like a professional dancer, but I'm mm-hmm. just, you cannot be smooth, struggle, despite yeah. dance together. <laughs> Guys, I, I love that's that's our, that's so. what I danced to. Okay, we're going to do a competition, not a competition. What? Really. Not, not a competition, <laughs> competition really, but really, I'm going to put you to the test. After the show, we're going to do. Of course, to still be on the show, we're gonna dance to your merry leg. It's okay. I will see if you really can beat this small girl. It's okay. <laughs> <laughs> All right, now let's talk about you know um, a lot of artists that are now successful. They have a lot of um, hustling they've done while growing up. Mm. That now they think about it and they feel that yes, I'm fulfilled. You know, a lot of people sold this, sold that on the streets, but now they have great things to talk about. So now I'm gonna ask you. You grew up on the streets, even though your parents were. You said your parents um, brought you up. Well. Was there any hustling, something that you hmm. did, you know, for your upkeep? Yeah. Without your parents. Yes. Or even with your parents. So tell us. Without them, no. actually. <laughs> okay. <laughs> like I, I hosted. I, I was, okay. Let me let me start from here. Okay. Do you want me to start to tell you what I sold? Yeah. Oh, nice the one. things okay. you did, you know. Hey, you moved to Yago. After I lost my dad. Oh. From um, age um, 9, 10, mm. I sold pure water. Wow. I sold sweeties, I didn't move away. No more, oh, wow. oh, oh, no more, yeah, I sold. And then I, I sold Zubu, unbreakable plates, you know, all those styled mm. soup, I don't want to mention brand. Mm. I yeah, sold, definitely. yeah, I sold them. And wow. um, well, when I grew up, I tried to get a job. Uh, it was messy, you know, I when you get offered for an, an, an they offer you a salary at the end of the day you don't get up to it or mm. in fact they don't even pay you at all mm. yeah. so i left that. i started to sell singlet singlet and boxers that one i'm very popular for that one if you go to my hood in seriously Bahagan, tell them ah singlet and boxers and he on you wow they kiss wow. that was already known as kiss okay. therefore you to know how they all say it yeah he kiss kiss me for singlet and boxers so i said i said um ukrika for children children of ukrika clothes I saw the pants and brands, just like that. I did. Now, you're, now that you're thinking about, when last did you talk about this? So um, I really never. So now that you're thinking about it, what's going on in your head? I'm just blessing God. <laughs> okay. Wow, wow. It's, uh, this, definitely in the future, even when you talk about it, I hope you'll tell your, your children though, and they will learn from me that, yeah. ah, mommy really so no, hard for I, us yeah. to get They here. would even have people, because I still have my old friends around yeah. so even if i don't want to talk to them about it i'll do something yeah you might be a yaki lotion so i would tell them you people better your mother so <laughs> okay now um, you studied mass communication yeah yes I and did. at some point you tried your hands you know on presenting uh, it wasn't like i i tried to you know okay. it, it just came naturally i mean i, I worked for a tv station yeah. for a while it wasn't yeah. like i worked it was a contract thing okay. yeah it was just for a little while and it's just part of me. Like I feel like I'm talented in different ways. I can act, I can sing, I can dance, I can present. I can yeah, what can hey. I do? <laughs> God, all oh, meta. Okay, all oh, meta. <laughs> go oh, go that song though, all oh, meta. How is how are you Bye, doing? <laughs> I don't understand. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. So I used to gonna do anything like that. You know, presenting. Probably you're working on having a show of your own. Nah, because you know, pre- present, present. presenting it's a whole career on its own. Mm-hmm. It's a big career, mm-hmm. and the music is, is is a career as well. Mm-hmm. So, uh, music is what I choose. Okay. Yeah, it's, it's gone. Yeah, it, it's not. It's not like it's gone. It's just part of me. So yeah. it's not mostly why it might just come out. Okay. So mm-hmm. I t- if I tell you to take over my show now, you do it. Well. I'll be glad then. I'll Please. collect the salary. Don't worry. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you very much. <laughs> <laughs> do you write your songs yourself? Yes, I do. All my songs. All the songs. No all my songs. But it's impute. No, impute. all my songs. Wow. Just so, me. what do you think about whenever you're writing a song? What goes through your mind? What message do you want to deliver? When you write and sometimes I think about the message I want to deliver. Okay. Sometimes it's just an experience I've had. Sometimes a story I've heard, or just the beat, and I'm like, okay, what can go on this beat that would okay. make sense? Okay. Especially the times of Shaku Shaku. That's when I yeah. start to like, oh, okay. Yeah. So, you know, it's just. Combination of all those things that inspired yeah. me, people around me as well. 
Okay. Most especially God, yeah, because without him, I don't think I have talent in the first place. Uh-huh. <laughs> I know, right? I know, right? Okay, you don't. You've had some collaborations with some artists. You did one with Fouls. Yeah. Um, Ill Bliss. Yeah, Ill Bliss. Now the rest, the recent ones, Slim Case. You know, what do you before? What are the criteria you think about? You know, in choosing someone that you want to collaborate with? Your song? Um, when when I had stupid yeah. with Fouls, mm-hmm. after I recorded the song, I thought, okay, you know, Fouls is someone that. It's, it's very funny and people yeah. here he has this comic book mm-hmm. inside there. Mm-hmm. So I didn't want to name the song stupid like the the proper stupid. stupid yeah. Yeah. I want it to be like stupid not in an insulting yeah. way. So I thought okay, first could bring out you know what I'm trying to send that say in this music, you really bring out the beauty mm-hmm. of it. So mm-hmm. I thought of Files and Files came came in the studio cool. recorded yeah. and it was funny yeah. that was what i wanted i want some sort of comic relief in the music okay. yeah. and slim case after yeah. shampe with dj exclusive featuring mm-hmm. myself and yeah. slim case people mm-hmm. loved it a lot yeah and we're like ah you guys should do something else you know give us they, they love the chemistry mm-hmm. and give us another one give us another one it was it was a demand mm-hmm. Mary was, okay. was based on demand wow. Wow. so we, we did demand it's too busy uh, on the beat uh, 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 The title of the song is Merule, Merule. and I, I've tried listening over and over and over again. I've not f- f- figured yeah. out what exactly you are Musile. Musile. Like, Merule. Okay. What's the other day? Amule. Nice. <laughs> the song, the song is on its own. It's yeah. a feel good music. Yeah. You know, it's just meant to make you feel good mm-hmm. and happy and lose. So it's dance some shock. Yeah, shock you me. understand. Make you lose up a little bit. Yeah. So Merule, Merule, you but. Merrily is, is a Yoruba word and okay. in English it means you know drop something like drop mm-hmm. with words, that kind of thing. Mm-hmm. So for me, for my own you know interpretation, yeah. it means drop the energy. Oh, okay. okay. You know, so release okay. the energy, you know. Yeah. Give it to me. Dance, yeah. let's make it be happy, yeah. you know, release this, that's that. Don't be that kind of thing. That's what it means for me. So Okay, yeah, and then I was listening to it, I was like, hello. Is she from my state? Or is she even from my town? <laughs> yeah, <laughs> where the Bele, Are you from under state? I'm from under state. Hey, wahoo! I'm from under town, bro. I'm from Okitiko. We are still close. Yeah. We are still sisters. <laughs> yeah. Why did you decide to put your dialect in the song? Why don't you just do straight Yoruba? You know, it is my dialect, like you yeah, said. Yeah. Yeah. So sometimes you have to bring in the culture and the music. Or some stuff. I was proud. Oh God! This is my <laughs> language. This kid was me from my town, you know. <laughs> I want you to do something for yourself right now. I want you to rate yourself. You want me to you rate know, myself? Do you think you're underrated or you are on the right pedal in Nigerian music? That's for people to really decide. Cause me, the truth is, if I'm to place myself. I don't even know where I'll place because the way I see myself, I'm above the world already. So that's a personal thing for me. Awesome plan. <laughs> okay. So let the people decide, really. I like that though. Seriously, I'm impressed with your response. You know, some would say, ah, yeah, I'm, I'm there. I'm there. <laughs> <laughs> but, uh, awesome stuff. Thanks so, for, so Thank very you. much for joining me on the show today. Well, I'm not letting you go without playing a game with you. I play games on the show. <laughs> oh, oh my god. Okay. <laughs> Betty Butter bought some butter. But she said the butter's bitter. If I put it in my butter, it will make a better okay. bitter. But a bit of better butter will make a butter better. So it was better Betty Butter bought a bit of better butter. <laughs> she tried though, she tried, she tried. Hi, <laughs> <Nice. laughs> like me. Yeah, you tried. Any last words for your fans or for everyone watching right now? Thank you so much. Thank you guys for always supporting me. I and mean, shout out to you guys. You mm. guys are fantastic. I get all your messages on Instagram and all my social medias. Thank you. Thank you for all the posts, the support. Thank you for sending that song, my song to your friend through Bluetooth. Thank you for downloading. Thank you for buying the music. Thank, thank you for turning up at my shows and making all the noise with kisses here. Yeah. Thank you guys so much. Thank you for supporting me. Please keep supporting the brand. I will not disappoint you guys. Yeah. Like she rightly said, she will not disappoint you guys. Thank you very much for joining me today. Thank you for watching the show. I hope you guys enjoyed this. Of course, when you have Miss Kiss on the show, you have to enjoy the show. It's been me from Kirishin right here. I'm 
I'm your host on today's episode and of course on every other episode of Celebrity Zone. Celebrity Zone. Till next week guys, be safe and of course it's time for our dance, dance competition. So stick around. Bye. <laughs> I said, hey, 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 h